are Driving narrow streets in a rusty car Leading to the sea, think we're getting close We should take a pick, baby, strike a pose oh, I remember every day that I spent right here with you Yeah, you are the one who makes me feel Feel as good as I do Baby, I wanna still act like we are 22 right We are one of the first people to stay here at the new Riviera Resort in Walt Disney World. This is over attached to the Caribbean Beach Resort and this is their newest Disney Vacation Club villa section. We are in room 8763 and we're in a one bedroom villa. Let's see how it looks. So when you first come in, they have some little Disney artwork there. A lot of the things in this resort down in the lobby and everything are all French. There's a little spot here to leave some stuff as you come in. And this is the view out through the kitchen and then this room here is a living room that has two different sleeping areas and I'll show that to you guys. Off to the side here, there's a linen closet here. And as you can see, this comes with a vacuum cleaner in here. There's a safe, there's a high chair, and there's a pack and play for anybody that needs it. There's an ironing board, and then there's some extra pillows, blankets, a steam iron up here, which is a nice touch for sure. Then on this side of the hallway, we have a washer and dryer. And this is one of those little pop-up laundry baskets. And there's some laundry detergent there. Then this bathroom has two different entrances so that the people that are staying in the living room can access it. And then there's another side for the master. I love the fixtures here. The gold has definitely come back in style. There's some more French artwork. They stamp all the tissues with the little RR for Riviera Resort. Beautiful tile work here in the shower. This is a rain head shower and it's quite large. There's a bench in here as well. Absolutely gorgeous. I actually like this better than the Grand Destino bathrooms. Then it opens off to this side. These have pocket doors in between here. There's some more racks back here for towels. And then they have these beautiful garden soaking tubs here. And again, a lot of the marble backsplash and tile work. And here's the master vanity, lots of storage. There's a waste basket under here. And these are the soft closed drawers. And here's a hair dryer down here. Beautiful chandelier here. And then as we enter the master, there's a nice desk here. Place to keep stationary. And then I really love the beds here. This blue is like a French blue. It's gorgeous. There's a bedside table. My kids are patiently waiting. We just left the Disney cruise, so <laughs> we are ready to get to the parks. But I wanted to film the room before we get settled in. Here is the closet in the master bedroom. Lots and lots of storage here. And there's a huge shelf on top too. Got a full length mirror here. There's a big dresser here with a large flat screen TV. And you'll notice here that they have their furniture bolted to the wall just for safety. So this is like chained on here so that in case somebody's child tries to climb the furniture. Here's the view from the master back into the living room. Again, with the French blue on the sofa. And this bed is really unique because that's a Murphy bed that lets down out of the wall. This 
This is also a bed here and another full-size TV. And this bed lets down like this. And you've got a little vision of Mickey lounging out on the French Riviera, taking in the rays. <laughs> very cute this table is pretty large it seats quite a number of people and then you do have a dishwasher here your coffee maker the toaster is in here you have all of your glassware if you guys have been watching my channel for a while you know we just put a similar tile in our kitchen that's the first thing my daughter noticed ours is marble but it's the same print here's some glassware for cooking and here's all your plates and bowls it's nice to have these square plates and the small plates are square as well you have silverware here and cooking utensils. And under here you've got measuring cups, mixing bowls, a cutting board. And then here's all the stuff you need to wash dishes. And here's another garbage can here. Looks like they have all Whirlpool appliances here. That is your full stove and oven. Let's see if they have anything over here. Oh yeah, they have quite a few utensils you may need while you're here pizza cutters and then here's your pots under here and up here you have stemware as well as some serving dishes and then on this side you have a full-size refrigerator and freezer we already put some waters in here we normally just try to bring water with us a case for seven dollars is the same price as two bottles in the parks because they're about 350 each so i definitely recommend you bring your own water but and now we're back at the front door this is an absolutely gorgeous room and I'll take you out on the balcony in a few minutes and show you guys what the view is from here. So as you can see, we have a view of the parking lot, but there's also a lake down here. Because there's Epcot right there. You can see the Epcot ball and then Hollywood Studios as well. So you probably will be able to see. This is looking down over the front entrance. They have all these beautiful pools down by the entryway. And then this is the path that goes down to catch the buses. And then Disney Springs is off there in the distance. You can see they have their balloon up today. This door opens from the living room and there's also a sliding door that comes out from the bedroom. And you see there's touches of Disney throughout, but just little subtle touches like this Mickey and the pillow here. But I absolutely love this hotel and we are excited to be here. ride the Skyliner for the very first time. We will resume your journey as soon as possible. Go right on board, okay? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.
Ladies and gentlemen, we invite you to sit back, relax, and enjoy the most magical flight on Earth. We are now traveling along Buena Vista Drive. This roadway and the city of Lake Buena Vista were established in 1969 when Walt Disney World Resort was first being developed. They are both named after Buena Vista Street in Burbank, California, where the Walt Disney Company headquarters are still located today.